मैरिज मिस्ट्रीज एंड डायमेंशंस बियॉन्ड इन दिस प्रोसेस पतंजलि यूजेस अ वर्ड कॉल्ड श्रद्धा मींस ट्रस्ट दिस इज नोन एज यकीन इन सूफी टर्मिनोलॉजी और सर्टिट्यूड इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू क्रिएट अ रैपो between two people rapo is an inner harmony of the two invisibles love is a rapo because it is an unseen but realized truth with somebody you simply fit as if you both were born for each other you call this love in a moment even at the first sight somebody simply fits with you as if you were created together and were separated now you have met again you have to join to begin this togetherness now this is a rapport which is at the core of love in old mythologies all over the world it is said that man and woman were created together in indian mythologies they have a very beautiful myth and the myth is that a wife and a husband were created in the very beginning as twins brothers and sisters together husband and wife were born as twins fitting together in one womb there was a rapo from the very beginning from the first moment there was a rapo they were together in the womb holding each other and that process is known as rapo which is the essential core element of love then due to some misfortune that phenomena disappeared from the earth but the myth says that still there is a relationship the man may be born here and the woman may be born somewhere far away in africa america america or india but suddenly there comes a rapo and unless they find each other there will be difficulty and it is very difficult to find each other the world is so vast and you do not know where to seek and where to find if it happens it happens by accident Aurobindo calls it explains it in one of his epic poems Savitri on the dumb bosom of this oblivious globe although as unknown beings we seem to meet we are not aliens nor as strangers joined we are bound to each other by a causeless force there is a power within that knows beyond our knowings that is the mystery the dimension beyond the known now scientists also believe that sooner or later we will be able to judge the rapo by scientific instruments and before somebody goes for marriage the couple has to go to a lab so that they can find whether their biological energy fits or not if it is not fitting then they are in an illusion this marriage cannot survive the ancient system of astrology to some extent works on this it comes from the two words astro from astronomy 
which is the movement of planets, movements of the stars and their effect on the human life. And logic comes from the discipline, the body of learning. Thus this word astrology came into existence. At the time when the child is born, many stars are and planets are at play. They create a harmony. And it is said, if we can create the same harmony through some methods, we can create a state of health. So they play an important role, their movements. That is why with the movement of sun, movement of moon, it affects the water level within us. And out of that, we have the biorhythm chart. Biorhythm chart operates at three layers, the biological layer, the emotional layer and intellectual layer. Out of this, the body undergoes change according to the face of the moon. You can see because of the face of the moon, the tides are low or high in the ocean. The same happens in our moods according to the face of the moon. And because of this, the physical process that happens within a human being is known as the biological cycle. If it is not fitting, when the couple has to go to a lab so that they can find whether their biological energies fit or not, if it is not fitting, then they are not in harmony, instead in an illusion, this marriage cannot survive. They may be thinking that they will be very happy, but they cannot be because the inner biology does not fit with one another. So you may like the nose of the person and the woman may like your eyes, but that is not the point. Liking the eyes is not going to help and so too the nose cannot help because after two days nobody looks at the nose or the eyes, then the problem is of biological energy, the bioenergy. The inner energies meeting and mixing with each other, otherwise they will repel. Bioenergy is like blood transfusion. If you transfuse blood, either your body will accept it or it will reject it. If it is of the same type, only then the body accepts it, otherwise it simply rejects. The same happens in a male-female relation or marriage. If the biology accepts, which is the first criteria of the male-female relation, it accepts and there is no conscious way to know about it. Love is very fallacious because love is always focused on something. The voice of the woman is good and you are attracted towards it. But that is not the point. It is partial. The whole must fit. Your bioenergies bio should accept each other so totally that deep down you are one person. There is no confusion. This is rapport. It happens in love rarely because how to find? Just falling in love is not any sure criteria. 
out of 1999 times it fails love has proved a failure that is why it is always important to discover a sort of rapport and with this the energies begin to flow in harmony with one another you are attracted towards one another beyond the biology beyond the nose beyond the ears beyond the eyes beyond the voice beyond all that is external patanjali has used the strong word called shraddha or trust or yakin or certitude as we use in sufi terminology 